used as uh, directed, insect repellents are extremely safe. Uh, both the American Academy of Pediatrics and the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention support the use of insect repellent in children down to two months of age, so long as they're applied correctly. The two most commonly utilized uh, insect repellent ingredients are DEET uh, and a newer chemical termed picaridin. Those are believed to be the most effective. In most studies, DEET and picaridin fare quite similarly in terms of their effectiveness uh, and seem to be superior to more natural repellents, things like uh, oil of lemon, eucalyptus, or citronella. The key is to apply a thin layer just to saturate the skin. Do it once daily, and very important not to apply insect repellents on open skin, so cuts, abrasions, other wounds, not to apply it near the eyes or near the mouth. Insect repellents should not be uh, applied by children themselves. Parents should help them apply it. Insect repellents should not be applied to children's hands because they're likely to transmit, transfer the repellent to the mouth or to the eyes. Uh, and really important, insect repellent should be rinsed off uh, every night with soap and water. When it comes to purchasing an insect repellent, parents should look at the labels. If they're purchasing a repellent that contains DEET, they really want to look for a 10 to 30% concentration. If they're purchasing an insect repellent that contains picaridin, the other highly active ingredient, the concentration usually ranges up to 20%. Uh, the higher the strength of the repellent, the longer the protection lasts, but in general, once a day is sufficient for most insect repellents. This brings up an important point with insect repellents and sunscreen. Uh, some parents are intrigued by products that contain both sunscreen and insect repellent mixed in one product, and those are discouraged from being used because uh, the application regimens are quite different. Sunscreen needs to be applied every one and a half to two hours. Insect repellents typically once a day is sufficient. There's good reason to use insect repellent in children and adults. Uh, bug bites are uncomfortable, they're itchy, they can be painful, they can lead to secondary super infection. Uh, but most importantly is what we're seeing now, uh, the fact that mosquitoes can harbor uh, mosquito-borne diseases like West Nile virus, and that's being seen throughout North America.